Hello and welcome to Western Oil Tools. Safe, environmental, innovative. How does yours measure up? My name is Condor Torres and today we're going to see how it works. This is our flapper ball pollution control stuffing box and it works just like this. In the event of a polish rod break, the polish rod is going to fall through and then you're going to have your mixture of oil and gases, water, everything rushing to surface. As soon as it gets to the flapper ball technology, that ball is going to be activated and it's going to rush up top and seal on the upper seat, eliminating any chance of an oil spill or any type of a spill coming out of the well. Your flapper ball housing, self-contained, one-piece unit, easy to check. Just take it out, check your housing, make sure it's all good. The ball goes back in, you can take samples and you can put it back on again and you're ready for operation. Misalignment, how does this work? Well, upon installation, you make sure your nuts are a little loose on the top. You install your stuffing box and then you allow the stuffing box to follow the contour of the polish rod. The stuffing box is designed to compensate for some misalignment of the, of the polish rod. So this nuts will automatically, one end is going to get tight and the other end is going to be loose. Do not over torque once the stuffing box is set and the position the polish rod is. You just simply tight the back up nut. We have this ones on a range from 1500 pounds to 5000 pounds. They're all for sour service application. We got different bottom connections. So overall, this is the best you can get out there. It's easy on the hands. It's a breeze to change packing and it's got everything you require. A trusty flapper, which is not a flapper, it's flapper ball technology. Regular upper packing, two and a quarter by three. You can use row packing, inject packing, uh, special V, fluid seal, ring packing, you name it. You just get the right packing for the right application.